In this tip, I'm going to show you how to resize columns in SharePoint. So I'm here in a SharePoint document library, and I've got a fairly standard layout. And what I can do is go to the heading uh, line here, and then in between the columns here, you'll see that I get the double-edged arrow. When I get to the border of the column, I can now push, drag, and drop, and I can change that column width to be exactly what I want. Now, again, that works while I'm working in the column, but as soon as I uh, go out, so if I go back to the home page and then come uh, back into this document library, what I'll find is, is that the library columns have been reset to the default. So when you do make a modification to the column width here at this point in time, uh, that will only be valid for that time you're working in that document library. When you move away from it, come back to it, uh, unfortunately, the changes you've made won't be retained and you would have to go in and make that change again if desired.